everybody. Welcome back to Everyday Thrifty Living. Cass and Odie's here. Hello. If you don't know, hope you stick around, hit the subscribe button, click the bell so you're notified every time we upload a video. And today we are going to be reviewing the Galactic Twin Spin Portable Washing Machine. Now this was an Amazon find. This is $169.99 on Amazon. And we got through Prime, so it came here in roughly two, three days. And this is a small portable washer. And dryer so this whole entire thing can hold up to 13 pounds of clothing this is eight pounds and this would be five pounds this is the washer part this is the dryer part or the spin cycle part see and it comes with the little see that to hold the clothes down this is of course the washer part very deep can hold a lot of shirts and a couple of pairs of pants. pants, a lot of socks, underwears. Uh, you might be able to put some sheets, one sheet in there or two sheets. Now, this product is designed for RVs, dorms, small apartments, and it's basically meant for piecemeal clothing. Oh, and the hose was in my hand the entire time. The hose is uh, so you could put it here and you could connect it to your to your sink, but. If it doesn't work, a lot of people, they just fill it up. Gallon of water, and just fill it up. That's so it has the three timers, the wash and timer. the hose to uh, uh, dump it. If it doesn't, if you, it's not long enough to go into your sink or go wherever, just get a, a, a bucket and dump it into the bucket. So like I said, so this is for meant for piecemeal. This is meant for uh, daily clothes. Like taking, you know, instead of taking it. A huge truck to the laundromat. I'm lazy. I hate doing laundry. So, so that's why I bought this. So yeah. So it's meant for, you know, not meant for comforters or anything. Not meant for comforters, you know. but it is meant for, you know, socks, underwears. And we live in a cramped little small house. I have no room for a washer dryer. So this was the next best thing. Okay. So we're gonna do little pieces here. We're gonna show you as we Hi, go. Hi, Buggy. He's so curious. All right, we have in here two jeans work and work jeans. Work jeans. Are work filthy. jeans. These are my dad's jeans. We have two of his jeans and one of his uh, shirts. So Odie is now going to. I'm not going to use the pump. I'm just going to fill it manually. She's going to fill it manually. Okay, she's now pouring the water in. Nothing's leaking so far, so we're good there. A little bit more, and we're good. Just a little bit more. One more shot. Ugh, daddy's so uh, clothes, yeah. Those are his clothes. Ew. Use too much detergent. All right, she has a report. A second bucket worth. I'm gonna put some detergent, not much, just half of what you normally would use because this is not as much clothes. Not as much clothes. So she's using the Tide one, and we're gonna add in a little more water just to fill and. This I'm is what she put does. Some of the game stuff in there. I know you're supposed to put it in before, guys. Put it in before you put it in. I made a mistake there. The, those little pebbles you're supposed to put in before. Just gonna fill a little bit more with water, and we're gonna turn it on. We're gonna wash this for. Okay, so washer timer. We're gonna probably go for 15 minutes. What's 15 minutes here? I don't have my glasses. 15. Yeah, it goes from three, six, nine. 15 and it's work it turned on there it is and it stopped wait wait you think your, pants, your father's pants are too dirty it's working it's taking a while we may have to do <laughs> okay <laughs> all right guys so there you go i think it's just too much clothes in there Oh my god. It seems to be working. <laughs> All right guys, let's be right back. Okay, after much checking and everything, it does it is supposed to do that because she took out one of his jeans. But it's not washing as good with two jeans. So. It's not washing as good. So two jeans is probably the absolute maximum. All right, so this is what this. I'm going to do. Okay, so while it is supposed to make that weird thing, she did remove one of his jeans, and she did add one, another shirt. So it looks like two men's jeans, jeans two humongous, just or just too much, but one jean and, and like maybe three, four, five shirts with four. like two to three shirts seems to be doing the trick because, I mean, I don't want to tell you, but oh my God, look at that water. Look how filthy that That's water filthy. Well, those are his work pants. Oh, work pants. But you know what? It's cleaning. It's doing it. It's yeah. actually doing it. Okay. 
Okay, it's been on for long enough. We are now going to make an attempt to drain. We have a bucket here. So we're gonna press. Be careful when before you take this off, even while you're washing, there's some buildup water in there. So yeah, so, so we're gonna careful. press the button to, oh, drain. No. No, drain, it says, where it says drain. I well, the other way around. I can't. Okay. <laughs> I can't. You, all right, we'll be right back. Okay, we figured it out. No, I have we to figured it out. Cassie has to use a little power. That's what she has to do. We are not having luck today, are we? I pressed the train. Okay. Wow, do we look like idiots or what? Probably. Okay. I have it set to the drain. Oh, unless it has to be like this. Oh, that's what it has to be. Put it back as a drain. Okay, so now we're officially draining it. That's why it's better. Some people put this in the bathtub. Okay. Okay. Okay, so we switched to the other one. As you can see, the water is filthy. Sorry about our stupidity, guys. Just this. I suppose that's what they meant that it has to be like this the water, you know. Okay. So it does drain the water, and let's see here. Yeah, it looks like it's draining most of the water. So, like I said, we have the one jean and the two shirts in here. And now what we're going to do is we're going to fill it up again with water, just water, just so we could drain the detergent out. And then we're going to show you, once that's done, we're not going to show you that. Then we'll show you the spinner. Yeah. So now we're going to finish draining, and then we're going to add more water to rinse out the, this would be to rinse out the detergent, actually. This would be to rinse out the detergent. Oh, filthy water. Filthy water. All right. So. Okay. We have done the second, we are doing, we are currently doing the second rinse. Wow, this is the. Still filthy. Look at that. That is filthy water still. These are, so. Yeah, those are my dad's jeans, as I just keep saying over and over. But, yeah, jeans are going to be tough to wash in this thing because of how much dirt it seems like they inherently... So, this is the second rinse. This is just to get... Um, and ideally, you want the water coming out to be white, like clear. Yeah. And... Yeah, so stay tuned for the spin portion. All right, it is um, now time. This is not going to fit much. No, so let's put two let's shirts. Oh. You have. Okay, we need that part because that's supposed to hold it down. Okay, so put this in. secure it like in. force it in. Yeah, like that. Something like that. Because now we have to put the drain hose. What are you doing? And then, uh, we have to we have to buy a bigger drain hose. We'll get the hang of this. I just wanted to try it, and this is the spinner, right? Yep. Okay. I'm feeling. I'm. Let's hope that. Oi, oi! Water everywhere. This has been the water day. Let's see. All right, here we go. There it is. Well, I will tell you, it does spin really good. Yeah. Um. You can see from there. Oh, so you have to keep it like that. Yeah, no, uh, it's true what they say. The best thing to do is just buy a separate hose. But, I want to even get a bucket or something. Because I'm not going to stand here holding on to this hose. That's not going to happen. That's why a lot of people actually do it in the bathtub. This is why people do it in the bathtub, not in the kitchen. The whole thing in the bathtub, but I, I'm, I'm not gonna let it drain like that near electrical stuff either. That's you know. Okay. All right. So the clothes are finally coming out of the spin dryer, and this is what the shirt looks like after several turns in the spin dryer. And for the most part, it is, I would say. 60 to 70 percent dry. I could put it in for longer, but it's just that with these shirts, they wrinkle so fast. So you just have to, so you could even just hang, has a hole in it. That's nice. 
course. It's his hill figure. Tommy so hill figure. It, 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 they smell like they just came out of the laundry. That they do. Yeah. They and smell they are, amazing. And they are clean. They are clean. So it's not bad. We're going to show another once we get the hang of this, guys. So that's it. Here so those filthy jeans are going to go So here. this has been the Twinsome portable yeah. washer and dryer. Down. I connected that so the water spins out that way. You have to put it on drain. And then you just. And then you just do it for like five, five minutes. minutes. And that and is. That is that is it for us. This overall has been a. I wow, would say. This machine really does not like jeans. It does not like jeans. It say. does not like my dad's jeans. Um, that is it for us. Overall, I think it's a pretty it good investment. It can be a really good investment, yeah. I think. Once, clothes. once oh. we get the hang of it. No jeans. So that's it. Like, comment, subscribe, and um, we will see. Have a great day. Have a great week. We will see you in the next video. And she's gonna have to hold on to this machine. Uh, bye, everybody. No, I secured it back. Bye. Okay. Say bye, bye. Bye.